Hi guys, welcome to Telecom Fact Channel. This is Salam Prasan Chandran. Today we are going to talk about common notes of the GSM architecture. Let me briefly explain the contents. GSM, Mobile Station, BTS, BSE, MSE, HLR, VLR, Authentication Center, Equipment Identity Register, GMSE, PSTN. 2G, Second Generation. 2G is a second generation cellular network. 2G cellular networks were commercially launched on GSM standard in Finland. 2G network uses digital signals. It enables services, text message, MMS and other services also. It provides better capacity and quality than what is meant by GSM. GSM is an abbreviation of Global System for Mobile Communication. GSM is an open and digital cellular technology used for transmitting mobile voice and data services operates at 850 MHz, 900 MHz, 1800 MHz and 1900 MHz frequency bands. It uses time division multiple access technique for communication purpose. This is a typical GSM network architecture. As we said earlier, mobile station, BTS, BSE, MSE, GMSE, VLR, HLR, Authentication Center and Equipment Identity Register. These are the components. Mobile station. It consists of physical equipment such as radio transceiver, digital signal processor and the SIM card. UM interface is used between mobile station to BTS. SIM is an abbreviation of subscriber identity model. BTS that is base transceiver station. BTS is an abbreviation of base transceiver station. The BTS is a term used to denote a base station in GSM terminology. A BTS consists of antenna and the radio equipment necessary to communicate by radio with the mobile station. Each BTS covers a defined area known as cell. A BTS is under the control of BSE and BSE is under the control of MSE. BTS is also called radio base station in 2G. BSE, base station controller. The base station controller is in control and supervises number of BTSs. The BSE is responsible for allocation of radio resources to a mobile call and for the handover that are made between the base stations under his control. A piece interface used between BSE and BTS. Mobile switching center that is MSE. MSE is a primary service delivery node for GSM and CDMA responsible for routing voice calls and SMS and other functionality too. The mobile switching center sets up and releases the end-to-end -end connection, handles the mobility and the handover requirements during the call and take care of charging and real-time prepaid account monitoring. A interface is used between BSE to MSE. Home location register. HLR is a database from the mobile network in which information from all the mobile subscribers is stored. The HLR contains information about the subscriber identity, his telephone number, the associated service and general information about the location of the subscriber. C interface is used between MSC to HLR. Visitor location register that is VLR. VLR is a database in mobile communication network associated to mobile switching center. The VLR contains exact location of the mobile subscriber currently present in the service area of the MSC. This information is necessary to read a call to the right base station. The database entry of the subscriber is deleted when the subscriber leaves the service area. B interface is used between MSC to VLR. Equipment Identity Register, that is EIR. EIR is a database that contains a record of all the mobile stations that are loaded in the network as well as database of equipment that is banned. Example, stolen or lost. The identity of the mobile station is given by the International Mobile Equipment Identity. Each time a call is made, the MSC requests the IMEA of the mobile station, which is then sent to EIR for authorization. F interface is used between MSC to EIR. Authentication Center. The authentication center is a function in GSM network used for authentication a mobile subscriber that wants to be connected to the network. Authentication is done by verification and identification of validity of the SIM card. Gateway mobile switching center that is GMSC. The gateway mobile switching center is special kind of MSC that is used to route the calls outside the mobile network. Whenever a call for the mobile subscriber comes from outside the mobile network or the subscriber wants to make a call to somebody outside the mobile network, the call is routed through GMSE. Public Switched Telephone Network, that is PSTN. The PSTN is the aggregate of the World Circuit Switched Telephone Network that are operated by national, regional or local telephony operator providing infrastructure and services for the public telecommunication. The PSTN consists of telephone lines, fiber optic cables, 
microwave transmission links, cellular networks, communication, satellites, and interconnected by switching centers. Thank you for watching. If you like the video, please like, subscribe, and share it. It may encourage me. Thank you.